She won't see me put it there, but I will point her at the log. Kathy Hornsby is setting up the training course with bumpers for her nine-year-old Labrador retriever Micah's morning workout. She's going to do a double retrieve and then a blind jumping the log. On command, Mike. Micah gets to work, sprinting across the field searching for the launch bumpers. Easy. Then she soars over a log to look for more. With some guidance, she finds one and proudly brings it back to Kathy. She uh, has a CD obedience degree and she has a senior hunter title and she has three of the needed five passes for her master hunter title. She was trained for tracking. But Kathy feared Micah's long list of accomplishments was about to be cut short. Maybe two years ago now, she started limping pretty badly on that back leg. The same back leg Micah injured and had surgery on as a puppy. All the years of running and jumping left the dog without any cartilage in her left hind leg. She kind of reached her limit. The only option for restoring Micah's active lifestyle was a full knee replacement surgery. It was a first for the UF Small Animal Hospital. Dr. Stanley Kim and Antonio Putzi performed the surgery with guidance from an Ohio State University canine specialist. Technically, you need to be very precise with the procedure. That's the main challenge. Micah's surgery was a success. Now, several months after the procedure, she is doing even better than her doctors expected. We certainly weren't expecting her to, to run field trials again, that's for sure. Micah! So now, with a brand new knee, Micah gets to continue field training and hopefully add more credentials to her impressive resume. At the University of Florida, I'm Chris Billich.